Um, wenn wir zum Garten gehen. Können wir Ja. So dass wir dahinter stehen, können wir dann... Ohne dass das Ding ausgeht, oder? Weil wir sind ja immer noch auf demselben. Geht das, ne? Okay, das geht. Das geht. Okay. Hatte ich ja doch die richtige Idee mit zum Gefängnis gehen und den anderen Typen kopieren. Dann sind wir jetzt eher da. Können wir jetzt hier rein? Das war ja easy. That should keep them busy for a while. Okay. Können wir die jetzt mitnehmen, warum auch immer? Snooze, an old fashioned type of snuff. Not too common in the city. Okay, Kautabak Kau also. Various medical supplies. Die wir immer noch nicht mitnehmen können. Katarina, can you hear me? I need to come up with a way to wake her up. Das können wir nur auf uns selber. Schade. Looks like Katarina needs oxygen to keep her stable. Ach so, Moment hier. Kann man da irgendwas mitmachen? Looks like an IV bag filled with liquid nutrients. Wasserhahn, Monitor, Verbände, blauer Schachtel, Verbandskasten. Ich habe keinen Schimmer. I don't need any water right now. Ja, aber vielleicht sie. A portable medical kit with all the essentials. It's filled with cannulas, those little needle things used to connect an IV. Hm. Got one. Oh. Eine Kanüle. Was sollen wir dann in sie reinspritzen? She's already got one. It's connected to the IV. Das ist richtig, aber ich weiß mal wieder nicht, was ich tun soll. Wir haben jetzt von der ganzen Aktion eine Kanüle bekommen. Wir haben eine Katharina, die nicht mit uns spricht. Den haben wir auch lange nicht mehr einsetzen müssen, den Scanner, oder? Ach ja, das Ding ist aus. Machen wir mal sicherheitshalber wieder an. Äh, du sollst dich als irgendwer verkleiden, damit ausgerechnet du nicht erkannt wirst. Das ist eigentlich alles, was ich damit erreichen wollte, liebe Vera. Da ist nichts Neues bei und hier auch nicht. Sagt ihr irgendwas zu ihr? Katarina Berg, aka Melinda, a school teacher in residence. I believe that she and Maya were both conduit members. 
Das glaubst du nicht nur, das ist bestätigt worden. Was mache ich mit der Kanüle? Aber wie? Womit? Was sollst du tun? Ja, was willst du tun? That combination makes no sense. Das ist richtig, aber ich kombiniere jetzt alles mit allem, was keinen Sinn macht. That combination makes no richtig. Warum? Okay, now what? Ich habe keinen Schimmer. She's already connected to the other end. Das da? In dich selbst, weil wir können uns heilen und vielleicht kann sie sich damit auch heilen. Okay. Katarina, how do you feel? Oh, like a million bucks, sister. Who did this to you, Katarina? That hag. What's her name? The foul-mouthed woman at City Hall? Stina Ruth? Yeah. Okay. I need you to repeat that to some police officers. Can you do that for me? I don't know about that. Sounds like you need my help, sister. What's in it for me? Please, Katarina. Now is not the time to argue. Your child is in danger. Wait, what? Did something happen? I didn't want to have to tell you this, but your child was taken from the apartment. No. Fuck. Okay, I'll help. She came out of nowhere, touched my forehead, and everything went black. My knees caved, and, and I could feel something greedily carving through my mind, nibbling at my memories. It was terrifying. And you're 100% sure that Councilwoman Ruth did this? I'm positive. I saw her clearly. Strangely enough, she didn't seem to care about hiding from me at all. Did you get a sense of what information she was looking for? Not really, but the whole process felt frantic, rushed. Why do you think she spared your life after this attack? Fuck if I know. Maybe she was interrupted or she just assumed I would never wake up. This creates some doubt about the Councilwoman's story, Agent. But I still can't let you go. But why? Do you really think I could do something so terrible? It's not that simple. Stina Ruth, a respected and powerful person in Nordson, claims that you conspired with the conduit to murder Leonard Dahl. A suspected conduit member is hardly a trustworthy witness under those circumstances. But I slept through the whole night in my room. You have to believe me. Who can confirm that? I can, to some extent. I know she entered her room at around 10. But after that, I went home. Hmm. Hey, Arvid, didn't you have the night shift that day? Oh, yeah. Nothing happened that night until you guys came back in the morning. Ugh, how can I let this... You're free to go, Agent. That's a relief. Let's work together to stop her now. Yes, I'm sorry. She got into my head somehow, and I felt powerless to stop it. Forgive me, Uncle. You were right all along. I'll resign and give command back to you. I accept. We've all made mistakes, Gabriel. I'm proud of you. It takes a man to admit when he's wrong. Now, Agent England, how would you like to proceed? Stina is an ex-agent and extremely dangerous. Given my training and background, I'm best suited to deal with her. Stay vigilant and be on the lookout, but do not engage with her unless you have no other choice. I will handle her alone. Understood. Oh, and before I forget, Here's your weapon. Good. I'll need that. Thanks. Let's meet up later at the station. You'll leave a deputy to keep an eye on her, yeah? She's far from harmless. Of course. Now, with that out of the way, it's time for us to have a serious talk. <sighs> Can't wait, sister. Please, Katarina. I'd like to find your child, but I can't go before you give me some answers. Fine. Ask your questions then. Okay. Before we begin, we have to disable that device in your arm. You're in luck. 
I can't feel it anymore, so the doctor must have taken it out. You know anything about that, deputy? Uh, yeah. Dr. Pearson had some theory about a foreign object in her body causing the coma. He cut out a small device from her arm. Noted. I'll have to ask him about that when I'm done here. I think it's time for some honest answers then, Katarina. Are you trying to revive AI? What do you think? Did you happen to skip past the conduit section in all those textbooks of yours? I didn't, but I'm trying to understand your perspective. What could be worth repeating the horrors of the collapse? AI had nothing to do with that. Alarmists and doom prophets were responsible. The old world was a place of wonder, you know? Limitless wealth and prosperity, and we threw it all away. We had to look out for ourselves first. Our families, our children. There was too much at risk. It's an irrational fear. Are we really that scared of anything greater than us? People treat AI as some outside force with an intent to destroy us all. AI is our own creation, our progeny. What sane parent would fear their children surpassing them? We're still seeing things through the eyes of the fucking primitive predators we really are. Kill or be killed. Anything remotely resembling a threat must be destroyed. It was an act of defense, Katarina, not one of aggression. <sighs> I used to be just like you. I wish Maya was alive. She could have helped you understand. Try me, Katarina. I'm really doing my best to understand. What's the point? You'll only use the information against me. You'll take my child away or worse. If you want my confession, you have it. Yes, I'm guilty of trying to save humanity. Yes, I'm guilty of trying to awaken Huldra, what you'd call an AI superintelligence powered by a singularity. I have a recording where Maya called your child a vessel for Huldra. You're trying to create a human AI hybrid, right? <laughs> You're wasting time. I'll tell you everything when my son is safe in my arms. Until then, I'm not saying another word. Hm. Okay, das war jetzt ziemlich viel auf einmal. Okay. Wir müssen das Kind finden irgendwie, aber können wir trotzdem noch mal mit ihr reden? Wir haben noch mehr Dinge, Katharina. Wie ich gesagt habe, nicht ein Wort, bis ich mein Kind sehe. Okay, also nie. Keep up the good work, Deputy. Sorry about the whole jail thing. Trying my best, ma'am. And, uh, yeah, you really pulled a fast one on me there. Gut. Gucken, ob wir den Doktor spontan finden, um nach dem Gerät zu fragen. Ja, natürlich ist er jetzt da. Dr. Pearson? Ah! Whoa, relax. Don't sneak up on me like that. <laughs> Sorry about that. I was told you found something in Katarina's arm. Oh, yes. A small tubular implant right here. Thanks. Have you been able to determine what it does? No, I can't make head nor tails of it. I'd suggest asking an engineer. Fair enough. Have you checked the other bodies for similar objects? Hmm. Maya had a peculiar wound on her wrist, but no implant. It is possible that the killer cut it out. And Carl? Alas, he was cremated before I got a chance. The next of kin was really fussy about that. Damn. Where are the ashes? Still in the oven. I was about to collect them. That one? No, the one in my kitchen. Excuse me? I'm joking. <laughs> you really need to lighten up, you know? I'll worry about that when the case is solved. Excuse me, doctor. It's the electronic wrist implant I picked up in the morgue. Wirklich? Gucken wir mal nach. Wow, the implant is still intact. It must be made of some strong materials. Gut. Fragen wir Walter. Wofür haben wir ihn denn? Er kennt sich doch mit Maschinen und so aus. 
Nur halt normalerweise mit weniger lebhaften Maschinen. Oh my god! Äh, uh, what? Are those. Are those. Robot eggs? Äh, <lacht> uh, Nisa, no, that's not quite. You better take those away before he gets excited. He keeps bugging me about a little brother. <lacht> du weißt also nichts darüber, ja? Hi again. Hey there. What can I do you for? Hm. Oh, my Okay, das ist der selbe Text. Äh, you Äh, uh, Okay, ja, okay. ja, yeah, ja, yeah, ja, yeah, ja, yeah. tschüss. Wie können wir denn sonst fragen? Wer hat denn noch Ahnung von Technik? Go ask an engineer. No need to go back in there. Ja, vielleicht hat jemand Ahnung von Maschinen da drin, deswegen. Im Museum und oben ist keiner, den man fragen könnte. Two electronic wrist implants extracted from Carl and Katarina. Ja. Katarina antwortet uns ja auch gar nicht mehr. Das heißt, ihr braucht mir das auch nicht in die Nase zu stecken. Hello again, Gabriel. Hey there. Can I be of assistance? Ja, weißt du, was das ist? Do you know what these are? They look like computer chips in some sort of protective shell. Clearly a third degree violation, right? Hard to say without the assistance of an engineer, but most likely, yeah. Ah, wo kriegen wir jetzt einen Ingenieur her? So, your uncle proves steadfast after all. Yes. Jokes on me for considering him a softie. So, do you know where I should search for Sina? No idea. I'd look up her address and start there. Oh, and don't beat yourself up for what happened. I'll take full responsibility. It was a mistake to listen to her. Ihr wart ja auch sympathisch, right, alles I'm gut. Off. Good luck out there. Das mit der Adresse wollte ich ja tatsächlich an anderer Stelle schon. All right, looks like her address is at 5 Lindgren Street. I think that's up the stairs opposite Walter Shaw. Ha. Okay. Den Rest brauchen wir, glaube ich, nicht. I had a few questions, Commissary. By all means. I never thanked you for standing up to Stina earlier. So, uh, thanks. Think nothing of it. I'm an old fox, and I don't fall for just any flimflam. So, any idea where I can find her? Not really. Check her address in the records. Already did, but thanks anyway. Do you know what this is? Clearly some kind of, uh, gizmo. <laughs> You're asking the wrong person here. Okay. That's all I needed. Very well. Okay, also wieder Richtung Walter. Und gegenüber ins Haus. Endlich! Oha! Sieht ja nicht so wohnlich aus. Ein old Badge von when Stina was a police officer in the city. A diploma for a specially distinguished service, signed by the bureau director. It's probably from back when Stina retired. Okay. That's the biggest bottle of booze I have ever seen. Various items to care for a baby. Stina must be the kidnapper. Also, ist sie vielleicht gar nicht dagegen, sondern will das Viech einfach für sich? A discarded beer bottle. I don't need to mess with that. A number of empty glass vials in a neat package. There were a couple of tapes here. Schauen wir uns gleich an. Die a brennt noch. Two. It seems that Stina is a woman of many vices. There's a tape player on the table. No tape inside. Gut. 
Report number three. After roughly a month of surveillance, I am sure there are no more than three people in the group. The leader and the young couple. I have been unable to determine the location of their mainframe, but it must be in one of the key locations here in Nordsund. They rarely go down to the ground. The shack and the junk heap appears to be connected to a large makeshift antenna, so they may have access to long-range communications. The leader keeps referring to her wrist implant as a key, but I'm not sure to what. In any case, we should make sure to obtain it when we strike. We're starting to reach a point where we know enough to take action. Let's meet after dark at the usual place and discuss our options. Leonard, signing off. Schlüssel mm also. -hmm. I know what you said, but I can't wait any longer. They're getting too close. The child will be born in a matter of weeks. If they finalize Project Holdra, it'll be the end of us all. I'll take care of their leader first. I've gained her trust, so it shouldn't be hard to get along with her. As for the child, the host, God forgive me, but it is an abomination. I will do what needs to be done. Make sure you destroy these tapes. If things go wrong, I don't wish for any blame to fall on you or my church. You have taught me much, Councilwoman. If I fail, I trust you'll find a way to resume my sacred duty. Goodbye. So, wo ist sie jetzt? So, if Leonard killed the conduit members, who killed Leonard? Mistina, natürlich. It's not too late, Stina. Give up now, and you'll get out of this alive. Gut, dass die aus Versehen She can't stay cloaked forever. in die Flasche getreten ist. Ich will mich auch unsichtbar machen können. Gut, den Mörder haben wir gefunden. Wir haben eine Heizung, wir haben Flaschen, wir haben ein Porträt. That was a close call. Looks like this hasn't been functional for a while. A few identical bottles. I would guess they contain alcohol. So, gewagte These, gewagt, gewagt. Not even a blanket. Stina must like to sleep rough. Oder sie schläft hier gar nicht. Vor kurzem noch gesagt, lange nicht mehr benutzt. Okay, wir suchen jetzt nicht mehr Fußabdrücke, sondern eine chemische Signatur. Finde ich gut. 